my name is Eamon McCann. Welcome to my new radio show, which will be running every weekend from now right through to the end of the year. I uh, will be have various guests, and of course many of them will be from the political forefront of current affairs in Northern Ireland. Today, to begin our show, I am joined in the studio by none other than Mr. Dr. Paisley himself, leader of the D.U.P. Oh, also, yeah. strangely, surprisingly by his side, is none other than Mr. Jerry Adams. And also, we hope to be joined later on by Antishok, Mr. Bertie Ahern. So, if I could begin today's discussions by asking Mr. Ian Paisley, how, in his terms, does he feel the Good Friday Agreement is going, Mr. Paisley? Well, first of all, I just like to thank you for having me on your show, you fucking socialist cunt. Secondly, I wasn't fucking informed that that beardy cunt over there would be fucking here. here. I fucking talk whatever the hell I want. Hey, fucking dry up beardy balls. I'm talking. Right? Uh, well, that's what you're going to get. Well, anyway, as far as the Good Friday Agreement goes, I and my party think there is no fucking Good Friday Agreement. And there certainly is no Good Saturday Agreement. And by Jesus, if I have my way, there will be no fucking Good Monday Agreement either. You want no agreement, Mr. Thank you, Mr. Paisley, for them chosen words, as usual, very, very carefully chosen, pleasant, verbal vocabulary to one's ear. And indeed, by the way, I am not a socialist cunt. You're thinking of the wife when she spreads the legs. But anyway, we'll, we'll move swiftly on. Uh, I would like to, uh, if I may, bring in Mr. Jerry Adams now to come back. And, Jerry, what is your view on the Good Friday Agreement? Well, uh, for a million migrants, even, uh, we would, uh, well, we, we, we think that we, sh we, we, we should be uh, uh, at a stage now where, where we can be able to sit down, sit down with Mr. Paisley. And uh, I think now we should be past the stages where we uh, trade insults. Mr. Paisley, you never, you never grow up here. You don't. You just come out with the same, all the same trouble all the time. And that the British government... We feel at this stage, Mr. Blair and his government should at this stage be, be stepping in to, to knock, to do your knee, I mean, uh, to have, uh, words with you. But anyway, uh, that's not never here nor there. Uh, we're, 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 we're very optimistic about, uh, talks of the future and all we can do is, uh, pray to the Lord and, uh, well, I think Mr. Paley would agree with me there because we're all under the same roof today. Ha <laughs> ha Jesus Christ, I thought you were never going to fucking shut up or fuck said that you can fucking raise the light as fucking long as you can talk to be a fucking good fucking thing, all right? And as far as us feel over the same fucking look, I fucking heard you before. When I'm talking, you sit down, cuntables. Hey, I'll tell you, suck us for now. Tell me, tell me, suck us for now, Eamon, or he's gonna get that fast twelve. Hang on. Jesus. Well, somebody fucking restrain that man. Your wife sucks cocks in hell. Gentlemen, gentlemen, please, please, we want a civil discussion here today, and we don't need to treat uh, personal insults. And, uh, please, if we, if we can just. Have, have a civilized conversation and we'll, we'll move on. Uh, yeah, what? Yes? Oh, I've just been informed that Pretty Ahern has arrived straight off the boat, or I mean the, 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 the train. And, uh, yes, uh, 
Well, Mr. Bear is just out there just to do one as he puts on his eyes. Uh, picking on his mate there. Uh, is that okay? Uh, yeah, t- 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 thanks, Damon. All right there now, you have to make yourself comfortable. Yeah, Jason says. Oh, Jason, do it to fart. Well, uh, you should have thought about that before you entered my studio. Well, Betty, what what do you want to know if you're listening to the radio in the camera as to hear what Paisley and uh, Mr. Adams here were saying? Jason, uh, I never, never hear so much shots in the army life. I was just saying to the partner there this morning when we were lying in their beds, doing a 69er, uh, just, yes, uh, I hope the guy that does, not the guy where we are. Uh, have to listen to the Paisley and the Adams go over the same trouble all the time. Oh, for folk for but they all try your fucking eyes. Damn, that big time, me eyes. You've had your turn, and now I've had my turn. Gentlemen, please, as I said, we do not want the trade personal insults. As for Jesus, Amen, you're not going to give me a chance to say what I've got to say. Oh, fuck it. Put it out. I'll let them have speak for you, big man. Hey, fuck it. Tell you that, shit, eh? Well, uh... Oh, uh, well, uh... uh what, what I wanted to say was, uh, before I was interrupted there uh, by, by the big man, uh... How we feel now? The old government down there in Dublin, uh... We, we, we have a few that, that, uh... We, we will talk to anyone who's prepared, prepared to, uh... Sit, sit with us and uh, in the dial and uh, the only thing that uh, we we recommend is that that you you don't have a beard and uh, you don't have a big nose with uh, a big grey map on the top and uh, them them the only things that uh, that uh, we as a say we but other than that we'll uh, we'll, we'll be able to uh, discuss the the things that that we think are the most important, and uh, uh, but we we find that the, the moment that that the, 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 the review of, of the Good Friday Agreement is uh, it's going as well as can be expected, I suppose. And uh, I, I think maybe Mr. Paisley and uh, Mr. Adams and uh, even 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 maybe you, Eamon, that we've all kind of in the way we in the way played for our part. Well. We at the fucking DUP have a few fucking things of our own. We will come and talk to anybody as long as they're not Irish, as long as they're not fucking English, American, Pakistani, French, Italian, uh, Gervaki Rodians, or any fucking people, usually with two arms, two legs, and a fucking head. But apart from that, well, I'm not going to talk to anybody. Well, well, I suppose you'll not even talk to the Martians, all if they lot. Oh, fuck, the Martians are really fucking landed. They're fucking living in the shop for you lovers down the fucking far road. <laughs> okay, Mr. Paisley, thank you very much, sir, for your input. And, uh, if we could move on. And I suppose I could direct this question at you, Mr. Paisley, uh, as it, it's to do with uh, a newly arrived... As a, as a, you could say, a new kid on the block in the shape of Mr. Jeffrey Daniel O'Donnellson. Mr. Paisley, there has been whispers in the corridors that he is defecting also from the DUP to Donegal to join allegiance with well-known singer Daniel O'Donnell to record a single. Is this true? And there are also whispers that they are going on tour around the Republican bars of Dublin. Would this be true, Mr. Paisley? Oh, fucking hope is not a way to start a fucking single career. Because he fucking sang at our Christmas party last fucking week. And I tell you that, man, it will bring tears to your fucking eyes. And that's not a fucking good thing, I tell you that.